I just want to share this with you guys. I've been wanting to do this for quite some time. I've seen this on TikTok. I have a water bottle here with half water, half bleach. I have a black shirt that I got from Walmart. It was like two or three dollars. And then these little stencils came from Dollar Tree. So I'm going to take it outside right now and spray it and see how it comes out. You guys, I don't know why this kind of stuff excites me, but it does. But it came out super cute to me. This is going to be Junior shirt for Halloween. I just have to let it finish drying, and then I'll wash it by itself. Anyways, I had all this stuff on hand, so I just thought I'd give it a shot. Now I'm going to go to Walmart one of these days, maybe not today, and get the whole family um, shirts, and then get more stencils from Dollar Tree, and then make us all Halloween shirts. We went to Stater Brothers. Actually, my husband did. And we spent $250. So I'll start over here with the produce. We got some russet potatoes, strawberries, some red grapes, some chopped romaine salad, cilantro, white onion, yellow onion, red bell pepper, some oranges, Roma tomatoes, watermelon, and some spinach. And then over here we got 7-Up, Cherry Pepsi, High C drinks, my husband got those. Uh, the kids have never had these, so hopefully they like them. Usually I get them the Apple and Eve juice boxes, but I'm assuming they didn't have those, and that's why he got the High C brand. We got two cases of water, a thing of Welch's fruit snacks, some orange juice, cran grape juice, apple juice, 2% milk, two things of Kerrygold butter, one is unsalted and one is salted. Some shredded Parmesan cheese, heavy whipping cream, pepper jack cheese slices, blueberry bagels, those are for Soraya, she loves those, and some honey wheat bread. Moving on over here, we've got some five cheese Texas toast, some steak fries, the DiGiorno um, deep dish pepperoni pizza, two things of broccoli florets, some Italian sausage, pizza bagels, you guys already know who those are mainly for, Junior, two things of shrimp, Two things of boneless, skinless chicken tenderloins. Three cans of black beans. You can't see the third can. It's back there, though. And then I'm sure my husband accidentally picked up these gluten-free corn dogs because we, we don't buy anything gluten-free. Not that there's anything wrong with it, so it's perfectly fine. We'll just eat it, but I'm pretty sure it was an accident. My husband likes these loaded potato skins. Some chicken stock. A bag of the chicken Florentine pasta. Some brown sugar. There's flour back there. Some Reese's peanut butter chips and some white chocolate chips. If you can't tell, I'm going to be making cookies. Some cinnamon toast crunch. And I actually needed him to get some um, of the Reese's pieces, but he cut Reese's miniature cups, so that's okay. But So while I'm out today, I'll have to find some Reese's pieces because I'm using them for the cookies. And then last but not least, some pretzels and then a bag of Lay's. Right, so we just pulled up to Home Goods. It's just me and Soraya, but y'all know I can't show Soraya. Anyways, I hope they have some good fall decor because I'm just looking for a few pieces. Anyways, we're gonna head in and then we might go next door to TJ Maxx. I'm not sure, but then later on we also have a um, Target pickup. This wheelbarrow is super cute. I love Frankenstein, you guys. This is Junior's um, theme in his room every Halloween. He actually has this, but it's a smaller version. I love that gourd, it's super cute. This is pretty. That's cute. Let's see how much this is. This is $12.99. These are super cute, you guys. This is nine, uh -uh. it's $9.99. You guys, this wreath is really pretty. This one's pretty too. 
and they're $29.99. Cute, you guys. This is not fall related, but this blanket is super cute. It reminds me kind of like the one I bought from Amazon. How about this one? I see some of my leaves over here. Ooh, falling leaves. I think this one smells good. I think I've got this before. Ooh, that smells good, huh? Smell that one. Little girl. You want that for your room? My baby's like me, you guys. She loves candles. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I've gotten this one before. You guys know the basket area is my favorite section in Home Goods. So we just got our drive up pickup from Target, but I just realized I need a couple things. So now we got to go inside. Lisa Bear say hi. Hi. <laughs> How was school? Good. Our Target spot is dry. This is a mess. These signs are cute though. I could do something cute with that with my Cricut. You guys know I had to come over to the hearth and hand section and I love this. It's $9.99. I can use this for the um, hooks I have in my kitchen. And these vases are super cute. I just wish they were much larger. They're $12.99. You guys, every time I come here, I look at this. But I would only use it for one purpose, a charcuterie board, and I don't make those often, but I really, really like this. This is really cute. I think I have some of these from last year. That pillow's different. This is cute. And you guys, this is super cute. I don't know if y'all can hear that loud, annoying noise. They need to get it together. I have another con right here. It's cute. You see what? I love those pumpkins. this face you guys I love amber so pretty that's cute too bottle of wine will get me every time a phone call away and you're ready to be mine This garland is super pretty, but it has like a gold shimmer to it, and that's not my style, but I think it's very pretty. So cute, you guys. Eighty dollars. They don't have much here in Marshalls. I do like this gourd, though. This is cute. I have these pumpkins. This is where I get most of my pumpkins from. For the joy of making up, we both. This is cute. I used to love this show, you guys. <laughs> Trying to feel safe. Can I get my ring clean, ladies? Ooh, almost dropped it. Oh, no. <laughs> you are you? 
Okay. You're closer to the thing, right? Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Sure. I'm just going to go to Bath and Body Works. Thank you. Uh -huh. We're here in the moment. We're breathing life. Both of us lost in the sun we lie. Right here on That's cute. Lisa, you like that? Look, it lights up. Oh, I think I want her. Come on over, let's pick up where we left off. You and I had lots of love just to top it off. We can run and down for days, never let it stop. I just want your everything, baby. Maybe later we can dance, never let Favorite songs on the radio Losing up and lose ourselves to this feeling Oh, I just want your everything, baby I'll be deep under your influence tonight Ooh, keep it coming, babe I don't mind another round Drinking from your body Okay, guys, so I had to hurry back home and make dinner Because I was just out way too late Um... I should have had this done a long time ago, but I'm making chicken fajitas. I already have the chicken, as you can see, cooking. It's almost done. The black beans are cooking. You guys know I put jalapenos and a little jalapeno juice in my black beans. And I will walk you step by step what I did, but it's just, um, I mean, the chicken fajitas is super simple, and I've also made this on my channel before. But here's all the seasonings I use to season the chicken with. You sleepy? Okay, it's almost done, okay? This is basically done, so I'm going to go ahead and add the veggies. So when I'm not in a rush, you guys, I would remove the chicken and then cook the veggies separate and then add it all back together. But when I'm in a rush, this is what I do. It works out just fine. But once it's all done, I'll show you guys what the chicken fajita bowls look like. And then once we eat dinner and the kids um, get in the bed, you guys, I'm going to give you a haul. So stay tuned for the haul because it's a pretty big one. Drinking from your bottle, baby, calling it wasting. All right, guys, so I just finished making the pico de gallo. And just for anybody who doesn't know, if you want to keep your cilantro fresh, cilantro like, goes bad super quick. I always put it in a jar and I fill it halfway up with water and then I'll cover the remainder of the cilantro with a Ziploc bag. And I know y'all see how low these cookies are, okay? I'm going to restock that, but I'm not doing that tonight. Okay guys, so here is how the chicken fajita bowls came out. This is mine. I would typically try to make mine with the cauliflower rice, but you guys, I literally have not eaten, not even one single thing all day, so I'm absolutely starving. Okay, you guys, so this is a, a good size haul. I wanted to share with you everything I got from Home Goods, Joann's, the Target pickup, when we went inside Target, Aldi, and then Bath and Body Works. Excuse those dishes over there. I just finished washing dishes. And so the kitchen looks a mess, but it's just, it's not, it's clean. <laughs> it's just that I need to put those dishes up and we have this haul. So I'll start right here. These things were actually waiting for me from Amazon. These are the kids' vitamins. I think I shared these vitamins with you guys in the last video. It was either the last video or the video before last. I think it was actually the video before last. But nevertheless, these came from Amazon. Bath & Body Works had their hand sanitizers for $1 each. And then I had two rewards, so I was able to get two of these for free. I don't know if you guys could hear it in the store. But that's so cute to me. So one's for me, one's for Khaleesi. And then this one is for Junior. I know I'm a dork. Anyways, I just did that because I didn't know if you guys heard it in the store. And I only got eight hand sanitizers. Looking back on it, I should have got a lot more. I don't know why I just got eight. Probably should have got like 20 of them. This is one of my favorites. This is Lemon Mint Leaf. I got three of these. We got two of these, the Feeling Awesome Strawberry Pound Cake. These smell really good. And then Khaleesi wanted this Blueberry Crumble. I got this flannel for Junior. And then Khaleesi also liked the Pumpkin Apple. Uh, so I had these two things in the refrigerator, you guys. I just had to pull them out. But I got some oven roasted turkey breast for sandwiches. And then I've never tried these honey barbecue wings. But I hear this Kirkwood brand, that's the Aldi brand, I guess. I hear that um, these wings are pretty good. So I wasn't going to grab two bags, but I don't know if we're going to like them. So I just went ahead and got one. And then, you guys, I've been wanting to try these Aldi candles for 
I don't know, a while now, probably a couple years. It's just I always fail. I've only been in Aldi probably a total of three or four times anyways, but every time I've went in there, I failed to get them. So, and plus I really don't like, like color candles like this. Like I'll probably use this during Christmas and so that'll be okay. Um, otherwise they have to go inside of a like candle holder so it really won't show the color of the candle because unless it matches the room it's in or the theme or something, I don't like these colors to show, but this smells really good. And these are only $4. So this is um, the almond apple tort. I love how this smells. I love anything. I like I like almond and I like apple. So this is, that smells really really good. And then I got this Lakeside Dreams, and this smells um, like clean linen or something. It's, it just smells fresh. So I like that. I'll let you guys know how, if you guys haven't tried these. I'll let you know how they actually burn. Like if they actually you know carry through the house. And then when I went into Target, I only grabbed a couple things. I grabbed this. This is actually part of the um, the pickup order. But anyways, I got this candle. I think it was like $3.50. It's falling leaves. It just smells okay. I don't I don't know what it's going to do. I heard somebody say that this smelled good, so I just grabbed it. I ordered it online, so I didn't even have a chance to um, smell it before I got it. But it's just okay. I got this hearth and hand serving board that I had showed you guys when I was in the store. It was $9.99. I needed some more apple cider vinegar gummies, so I got some of those. I got two things of the organic gummy bears. Like I told you guys earlier, I need to restock the Oreos, so I got some Oreos. And then also when the video started, I told you my husband accidentally got the wrong um, Reese's, so I got the Reese's Pieces for the cookies that I'm going to be making. And then Soraya wanted these red velvet cupcakes. The Target pickup was just geared around like household items because we had got groceries earlier and you guys already seen that haul. Got some gold bond lotion, some rubbing alcohol. I prefer the 90% but they didn't have it so I just went ahead and got the 70%. This is the only toothpaste I will use you guys. Some panty liners, two things of Downy Unstoppables, some Suavitel, Clorox wipes, Tide powder, some Dawn dish soap. I actually thought I got a bigger one but that's okay. And I also thought I got the bigger um, Clark's bleaches. But anyways, I got two of those. Some flushable wipes. These are my favorite gloves. Got two packs of those. I got some Mrs. Meyers apple cider. The apple cider scent. I didn't need the spray. I have a brand new thing of spray. So I just got the dish soap and the hand soap. I got four of the dial hand soaps for the bathrooms. So that's everything that I got from the Target pickup. Um, moving on to Joann's, you guys. I got this ghost. Let me show you guys. This is so cute. I can't wait to use this for Halloween. And you guys, this was on sale. I think I got it. I don't remember how much I paid for it. Let me look at my receipt real fast. Okay, so this was regularly $100, but it was 40% off, which would have brought it down to $60. But there is this little nick right here. I don't know if you guys can see it. This little tiny nick right here. Nobody will ever be able to see that. Um, the lady was so sweet. She took $12 off for me. So I only paid $48 for this. So I think I know exactly where I'll put this for Halloween, but this is super cute. And then I got this stem. I wish they would have had more of these, but they only had one left. I love the way that looks. This was $12.99, but I think the stems were, they were either 30 or 40% off. I can't remember. And then I got these two pumpkins. These pumpkins might be going back. I'm not sure. I have a ton of pumpkins. You guys, in a second, I'm going to show you um, my bins, my fall bins my husband took out for me. But I have a ton of pumpkins, but I just, I love this color, um, green. And so I, I use a lot of this color and white and just like neutral colors for fall. I also incorporate other colors, but this is like my main color. So I think these are, um, those are really pretty. So those were the items that I got from Joann's. Moving on to Home Goods. So I got this Lazy Susan and I love that it's black and white because it matches my kitchen and it's the OXO brand. You guys know I love that brand and it was only $7.99. And then I got these two pumpkins, which I absolutely, I just think they're different. I like how they look. They're uh, material, they're fabric. I don't know. They're just really nice. I think they look really nice together, like the contrast of them. And these were $12.99 each. And then I got Soraya two candles. This one is Falling Leaves and this one is Harvest Leaves. They smell very similar. I like how this jar looks better, but um, anyways, it's for Soraya's room. They're for Soraya's room. And then for Soraya's room as well. She's actually gonna let me decorate her room for fall, you guys, so I'm excited. I'm only gonna put a couple subtle touches, but I, I decorate basically my whole entire house for fall. Maybe not the whole entire house, but 
most of it. Um, Christmas, I get I decorate the whole entire house, so every room gets some decor. But for fall, um, fall most rooms do. But anyways, I'm just excited because she's gonna let me decorate her room, and so she liked this pillow. She wants this color in her room. It says so very grateful. Clearly, you guys can read. But anyway, she wanted this pillow. It was I think it was like sixteen dollars. It was sixteen ninety nine. And you guys look, this is what I'm most excited about. Look at this wagon. This is so freaking cute. You guys, I have a small obsession with wagons. I have a couple, like I have one on my porch and then I think we have one in the back, but I love wagons and this is a perfect size. I know exactly where I'm going to put this and what I'm going to do with it. It was regularly $50 and then there is a, it's on the other side there. One of these wheels are like slightly dented in. I was just scoring today y'all with the like slightly damaged stuff, but it's slightly dented in. I'm sure my husband could just knock that out. And even if he can't, it's not a big deal because you can't see it really. Um, but it was $50 and then the guy, um, the manager took, he was really nice. He took $10 off for me. You know, home goods don't be taking no $10 off. You know, home goods usually only takes 10% off, but he took 20% off. Anyway, so I ended up getting that this for forty dollars so i'm super happy about that because you can't beat that let me give you guys a closer look of like what it looks like and this is what it looks like inside anyways i thought this was super cute so i don't know how much money i spent today i don't even want to look at them receipts y'all but um i feel like i got well, first of all, all this stuff is like things I need for the house, most of it. But the things that I got for fall, I really like the things that I got. I feel like I got some nice items, and so I'm happy about that. You guys, but look at these bins. These are the bins I was telling you about that have all my fall decor. So I have three large bins, one small one, and then two, two bags right there. <laughs> so I have a lot of fall decor, and I need to go through this stuff. You guys, I almost forgot about these. I looked over and I was like, oh, I got these from Home Goods. I totally forgot. But I don't think I shared the chair cushions I had got on this channel. I think I shared it, shared the cushions on my main channel. But I got some cushions from Target. I didn't really care for them. I mean, I like the way they looked, but they were small and kind of flimsy. And each cushion was $10 each. Well, y'all, I got this from Home Goods for, for $24.99. Okay, so I picked up four of these uh, chair cushions from Target. It's the Threshold brand, and these were $10 each. These don't um, completely cover my chair, so these definitely will. I do love the Ticking Stripe. I absolutely love Ticking Stripe, but I think this is super cute, and I don't even know. Y'all, I'm so tired. I don't know if I told you the price, but I got all four of these for $24.99. So these little suckers is going back to Target, and I'm going to get my $40 back because I got four for $25 as opposed to the $40, and this is, these are like better made they're thicker and they're you know they're wider they're larger and even though these are for the you know the table over there I think this is gonna look super cute because I have this going on right here in the family room these colors so that kind of like all ties in together anyways you guys y'all had to go throw this hat back on because my hair just looks a mess and look you see my mascara is running I'm, t I'm tired you guys I have to still put all this stuff away behind me so I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here um, the kids are asleep so that's good so as soon as I'm done putting all this stuff away I can go take my shower I thought I was gonna be able to edit this vlog tonight but it doesn't look like I'm going to so I'll probably just do it early and um, like as soon as the kids leave but I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give me a thumbs up and then I'll see you guys next time bye Maybe later we can